Welcome to Chapek. We are one day before Watches and Wonders start, and this is the reveal of our new collection, Promenade. Now, Promenade is the child of the Antarctic, that all of you probably know, and our first iconic piece, which was the Kelly Bear. So why is it so? Because not everyone likes sport watches. And a lot of you came to us saying, we love that movement. Please make a version of that movement into a watch with blugs. So we did it. We created that watch. We created a watch that was at the same time sleek and chic. That was really elegant on a small diameter. And then we ended up with the idea that a small second at 430 was a way to create a difference with everything we had done. But then our advisory board, made of shareholders and collectors who love the brand and know it from very long ago, started saying, hey, but you don't have to do sub-dials at 4.30 and 7.30. And yes, of course, I said, because you never want to have a success become your own prison. You want to be free. So if you create a success, you probably have to break it a bit to make the success of tomorrow and to show that you are the creator. You are free to continue to create in every direction as long as you keep the style and the personality of François Chapek. As long as you stay true to his quest of beauty. And so that's what we did. And the first idea was actually coming back to the Quai Maybe you remember this guilloché made of ripples, you know, the idea of stone skipping on the lake, ripples are coming and eventually crossing, creating the design of the guilloché. Well, here, because we have only one sub-dial, it's only one set of ripples. And that's why we called it good dough, drop of water. And this good dough is actually starting from the sub-dial and goes all across the, the, the dial. It's made of metal. It's a dial made of silver, flanky, so stamped with an enamel on. Maybe you remember the Lanikai, the piece we launched in April last year, just after Watches and Wonder. And this piece was named after a famous beach in Hawaii with, a, with the water that is turquoise color. And we had to scout a very special enamel to create that color. And then we had to hand engrave the matrix that would create the dials to reproduce this idea of dune of sands below the water. Now, this is the same technique. The blue is different. This is our own blue, what we call the sapphire blue. This blue was scouted by Claude Eric Forrest, and we keep it as the blue reference number 573. We love enamel. And this one is really mesmerizing. And we also love guilloché. So guess what we did as a second model? A new guilloché. And this time, we called it guilloché soleil. And the reason is very simple. It looks like a sun coming out over the mountains in the morning and radiating from the sub-dial, from the small second, over the sky that is the rest of the dial. So you can see hours and minutes on the flange around the dial. And the rest of the dial is completely pure. And the soleil effect also plays from the cut of the engraver. It was invented by two rare people, Yannick and Jan, who work at RVK, one of the companies of the Metal and Group. And they love the way we work, the collaborative approach that makes that it's not our watch, but the watch of all the rare people who have collaborated around it. So they come with ideas, we come with ideas, we merge these ideas, and in the end, something is created. So we have a first variation in this beautiful ivory slash champagne color. And the second one is this beautiful night blue, which maybe stands out from its discretion. It's like a sun in the night. You can see the soleillage even better because of the darkness of the dial. And this dark blue sheds a light on the handcraft of the men and women who have been working so many hours to make that dial. So here is the promenade, our latest collection. 
It plays with styles, it plays with colors, it plays our, with our past, the Kedeberg, it plays with our future, it plays with the SHX5, it plays with everything. And I can't wait for you to discover it.